What's up everyone, TechLoud here and in this video I'm going to show you that uh, how you can extend the storage space of your uh, Nvidia Shield tablet. The Nvidia Shield tablet at the moment comes with uh, only 16 GB of storage. The 32 GB version is not available at the moment and it will come with the LTE so that's why it's taking slightly longer time. I've already inserted a 64 GB SanDisk micro SD card. This is the Extreme Plus version and this is the top of the range uh, micro SD card by SanDisk. So this is the fastest uh, micro SD card by SanDisk and you actually don't have to have this one. I happen to have uh, this one and uh, so I'm going to use this one because you don't need actually that fast card inside your Nvidia Shield tablet or Nvidia Shield portable to run the games uh, smoothly actually i use the samsung class 10 uh, micro sd card in my nvidia shield portable and it works uh, brilliantly and uh, so you don't have to have a fancy sd card anyways let's go to the storage and uh, you can see the available storage at the moment is uh, 59 gb on the sd card so let's go to the apps and uh, Let's go to the downloaded apps because these are the apps that I would be able to move. And uh, let's move the Modern Combat 5. At the moment you can see it has uh, 2.6 GB free storage on Shield and uh, let's move it and let's see how much uh, space we can recover and whether we will be able to recover the almost a GB from uh, the Nvidia Shield. Right now it's a 0.93 gigabyte uh, that is been taken by the app and rest of the 127 megabyte is the data which if you want you can clear anytime. So the app was almost a GB, 0.93 GB to be exact and it took actually almost a minute to move uh, this uh, app from the internal storage to the micro SD card. So as you can see the app has been fully transferred to the SD card and now the free space on the internal memory is 3.5 GB and so it seems that I have managed to recover fully the full space the 0.9 GB out of the internal memory and that's very nice to see. So let's uh, move another game. Let's move uh, GT Racing 2 as well into the SD card. This is actually a little bit uh, more smaller than the Modern Combat 5 and uh, it actually took a little less than uh, one minute. So now you can see I have uh, managed to recover another uh, 0.9 GB of the internal memory and now the app has been fully moved uh, the whole 870 megabyte has been moved to the SD card and now the free storage on the Nvidia Shield is 4.4 GB so in this way you can uh, move the downloaded apps to your SD card the reason why I'm saying downloaded apps because you cannot uh, actually move the pre-installed apps to the SD card for example the tablet came actually with the trying to game pre-installed but uh, you cannot move uh, this game to the SD card as you can see the option is not enabled. Similarly you cannot move uh, other Shield and Google apps. Since I have uh, moved the game to the SD card so let's check out after moving the game to the SD card is there any gaming performance difference or not. So let's run GT Racing 2 and let's find out. What's going on, kid? You good?
So as you can see the game runs uh, pretty smoothly and uh, I don't see much difference between the internal memory and the SD card performance difference. So guys I hope uh, that you have liked the video and if you have liked it make sure you press the thumbs up button at the bottom of this video. Take care and I will see you later. Bye.